Oh no, it's Xehanort! It's the uh, spell, what is it? District 13, level 13 or whatever. So they're called Asians in this game, but they look nearly identical. Yeah, I know. I know. It's, it's, it's fucking Kingdom Hearts. Come on. <laughs> so I don't follow lore on any MMO. I'm going to be asking you lore questions. So what you're seeing now, Bruce... Uh, please tell me, please tell the, me. These are the events that ended the, uh, the 1.0 arc of the game. So the game came out. It didn't do so hot. And so they started a project to Five reboot it, years. basically. Have and that was Realm Reborn, or 2.0. But they kind of worked the events of the 1.0 portion of the game into the storyline. That's Got essentially it. the video you were just watching. Is there was a giant dragon, a very uh, noble mage man sacrificed himself to teleport the Warrior of Light, which is you, Bruce! Uh, wait a minute, aren't you a Warrior of Light as well? I also am a Warrior of Light, but you are the single, as far as you know, Warrior of Light! <laughs> <laughs> so that's exciting. That must feel awfully special. I mean, it feels I, as special as about as uh, being the dragonborn in Skyrim. So extremely special. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lawrence, I'm, I'm character selection or character creation, pardon me. And uh, do these different races have different traits or does it matter? Uh, I don't think it matters. I think it just matters where you can, like, what city you start in. Oh, my goodness gracious. I just took off her clothes. I didn't I did not mean to do that. Be careful, Bruce. This is this is not a horny game. This is a classy game. What? Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Does it matter if I pick Seekers of the Sun or Keepers of the Moon? I, I don't know. I don't remember. I don't even know if that means right. anything. I'm gonna be Keepers of the Moon then. Done. Mm -hmm. I'm just doing randomized because that's the way I like to do character creation. A lot of people well, like to spend hours character creating, and I don't. I like to just do random. I think it's fun. Oh yeah, got her. There's there's a, a part of being a character even more important than how you look, and that's your name. Every name is taken now in this video game. Mm. You'd be surprised what you can do with the first and a last name. That's true. Mm. Reggie Pringles, that's good, Lynn. That's really good. <laughs> that is really is, good. I I'm I want her to be decidedly feminine. Dusty Fork. That's gross. Not very feminine. Uh, <laughs> Regina Pringles. This is. I'm gonna regret this name for as long as I play this game. There we go. You're going for it. Okay. Re Re Regina Pringles. Oh, now we're talking. Oh, it's sky. It starts out sky like Skyrim. <laughs> You start in a wagon and you wake up. I love it. You're finally awake. Look at that first person camera. Aren't you immersed? Well, they're just kind of like you're there floating around and then I just see text on the screen. So nobody's really talking to me, Lawrence. Well, yeah, you got to like say it out loud to yourself. You got to mumble it, but under your breath. Otherwise, they'll throw you out of the public library again. <laughs> so what do you think about the story so far? I barely read it. Oh. I haven't read it at all. So if you want to explain it to me, you're you're more than welcome. OK, well, you were on a cart. And now you're in a magical fantasy land, and you don't remember anything. Pretty atypical for an RPG, I know. Uh, <laughs> oh, there you are! Wait, what? There you are! Who are you? I'm on the bridge. I'm waving. Where are you? Where's right the little in front guy? of you. What the hell are you? Are you an armadillo bowler? Wait, what? Wait, hold on. What are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> are you Clouderoth Cephalad? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I got a little... I got a little... I got a little, uh, soul patch. There. You are adorable. Thank you. And you're a tank? Uh, yeah. Milady will not suffer a single scratch while Cloud Roth is around. <laughs> Alright, so it says, do you vow to embrace nature? Yeah. Take I mean, hold of it. Is that Tell it what that to do. Everybody has to do, or is there like another way to embrace something else? Like, is that a choice? or a, no. Oh no, you will not lock yourself out of anything in this game. Okay, right. uh -oh. And dialogue options rarely matter. It's Final Fantasy. So I see like, um... Markers on the map that are like like evil faces. Oh, what is what are those? What those are those are fates, um, which is those are like the public events in Destiny. Oh, so if we just run in there okay. and uh, each one has its own like kind of objectives, but we can just dive in there. You want to give it a shot? I see a big ass scorpion. That's a yeah. big. I don't know that we're gonna be able to kill that, right? Let's kill it. Oh, it's level fifty. Oh, oh, oh this, guy. Never mind. this guy. There's a lot of big boys. Okay, this guy is not the level fifty. I think he's the guy we got to beat up, but we have to not get murdered. By the All right, I'll beat him up. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. Hey, is there a way? To, can you do you tab through? Uh, do you like tab through targets? Yeah, targets. Yeah, tab will tab will uh, go through targets. They're, yay! Remember to slap these uh, slap these crystals when you're next to them too. 
Oh yeah, you're right. That'll help. That'll help getting around. You don't have to run across the whole city every time. I love that it's called the Ethernet, guys. I love it. Oh Christ. Oh Christ. What? I regret to inform you, I didn't even think about that until just now. Ever really? Once. You never ever once thought a computer science master such as Lawrence Sontag himself? I get so fully immersed and transported into the realm of Eorzea that it just doesn't occur to me. I can't believe it. I'm going to be honest with you. I thought for sure. I may be a computer scientist, but Clatteroth Cephalout is not. <laughs> oh man, okay. We're going to go kill some stuff. Oh good. That's usually why we, why we leave the city. There's monsters out there. Monsters and whimsy and adventure. Like ladybugs and squirrels. Holy balls. All the trees are mad. What did you do? I didn't do nothing, dude. Okay, defeat the friendly creatures. Bruce, you're fighting some like mutant tree and I'm watching a dude in a white shirt with a feather in his hat bash out uh, three blind mice on an electric guitar over here. Hell yeah, that sounds awesome. We did it. We did it. All thanks to me. You better get used to saving the world. This won't be the first time. Oh man, there's some deep lore shit going on over there. I mean, they're not explaining it, so I'm just kind of standing here in silence. Don't worry, they'll get around to it in like eight years. <laughs> ah, I see. I have to do things for the crystals to reveal themselves. You must go kill five boars to reveal the crystal. Oh my gosh, Sukiyoko gave me a minion. A goose. Yeah? Oh, you already got a goose? That's let's, perfect. Let's, really there excited. it is. There it is. Uh, it's <laughs> perfect. Oh my gosh, that's a fat... That's a fat guy. Where? That's a fat bird. Whoa, so fat! <laughs> Such a fat bird! Oh. oh, there's something big down here. A level 12 sapling. Should we beat it up? Should we try? Yeah, let's beat it up. Oh, whoa, a lot of things just got mad at you. What just... Hey! These monkeys are throwing rocks! Man, here come more! Yeah, this is part of a... part of like an event. Oh, okay, alright. Breaking Bud, get it? Wait, get is it? that what it's called? Breaking Bud? Yeah. Really? They make Breaking Bad puns in a Japanese game? Oh, it's gonna get worse. Nice. Nicely done. Ooh, leveled up too. Nicely done. I'm gonna get a little victory shout. Ah, <laughs> fearsome. Oh, level 25 scorpion. You wanna beat it up? I don't think we can. I mean, I. You wanna try? Bane might. It's got its own name. Be careful All to right. not aggro the other one. <laughs> Eat my ass, Bane might. Eat it. Oh, no. Oh. That does so little damage and I'm missing a lot. Uh oh. I, can, I don't know if I can do enough damage to keep aggro off. Oh. <laughs> a friend helped. Oh, there's another one! Ah! Holy shit! Oh my gosh, oh, I, think... I did eight damage. <laughs> they're, they're just helping us. Yeah. Well, that's... I, you know what? I appreciate it, but also unfair. Hearing that calm water relaxes me after all that pitched battle. <laughs> you hit the scorpion twice? Yeah, I don't even know if it was twice. Okay, this seems to be a quest. I don't know why. Murdering oh. squirrels? I mean, right. didn't mean to... We can do it. I don't know why. You're the hero, I'm, after all. On, on level one. <laughs> I'm a warrior of light or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Stepping on a squirrel's head. <laughs> Take that. Ah, uh, whatever. I got some skins out of it. That's right. That's how I know I'm a hero is when I get squirrel skins. A grocery bag filled with bloody skins. <laughs> Bring it back Take to a wizard. Here you go. I know this is what you needed. You pervert. So I think if I do this, it'll, it'll spawn a fungoir, so get ready. I'm ready. There he is! I'm taller than the fungoir now, finally. Now, are you standing on a stump? Yes. <laughs> I'm tall boy. I'm angry. Rawr. Yes. Bungwar! stump. All right. You bring him over here. You bring him over okay. to the stump. Oh, I'm going to mess you up when you get over here, buddy. All right. Now stab here him in the head. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> that makes the splinter cell sound, too. Believe it or not. Those goggles. 
I mean, like a an elite, an elite spec ops wizard is a really cool idea. That's the uh, the next evolution of Tom Clancy, Magic Rainbow Six. Ooh. Yep. Remove blue trumpets. Is that, uh, is it up above? Look at how whimsical this is. Look at this big old tree. This is this is some kind of Final Fantasy, huh? <laughs> Didn't expect to see this today, did you? A big old tree like this. I actually did. Uh, <laughs> most of oh. those kind of do look like this a little <laughs> bit. Yeah, big trees. Oh, Bruce. There's a big what? ass fat cat to the left. I'm busy doing. I mean, you know, I'm busy cleansing the world. If you can hold yeah, on. Yeah, it's really round though. Look at you! You got a new sweater. I got a new helmet. You look ready for fall. That looks real cozy. It is cozy. Thank you very much, Lawrence. That's a I'm gonna I'm gonna cozy up and play Skyrim all day kind of jacket. 64 ounce Baja Blast in the cup holder. Oh, that sounds Skyrim nice. Skyrim in the PS3. <laughs> Diarrhea in the toilet. That's Saturday, baby. Well, no, it's not this way. Uh oh, we ran into their home and now they're attacking us. You know what that means? Kill them. Not today, Kikirin Scrambler. Whatever your name is. Yeah, that one's a tough one. Take that, wildlife. We want our kind of nature, not your kind of nature. That's right. If nature is something we don't like, then we kill it. But if there's other good nature that we like, then we keep it. If, the, if an article goes around the internet and it's like, oh, this animal's in danger and it's really cute and adorable, people are gonna donate money just out of nowhere to make oh, sure that yeah. it stays alive. Yeah. But then they're like, hey, this fish is about to die, and it's just this blobby, gross, <laughs> farty asshole. You're like, who cares? So I think before long, we're going to lose all the ugly animals that nobody wants. They're just going to go away. I'm going to be honest with you. That sounds like a better nature to me. Like these stupid bog yarzons getting on my ass. <laughs> Get out of here. Yeah. You guys can go extinct for all I care. I'm not contributing to that GoFundMe. Save the bog yars on. Get out of here. <laughs> That's garbage. They look like shit. Yeah, what's going on over there? We're, we're, we're doing a big Ixali war. Ooh, that sounds important. It is important. We're fighting them off the guardian tree. <laughs> I'm glad you. I'm glad you got there. I know it was important for you. I well, have been talking to Lawrence for weeks about how I wanted to finally get to the guardian tree fight. Yeah. There's one person. That needs to be fighting in the Guardian Tree War. It's Regina Pringles. <laughs> All right, well, I picked up another level. Uh, are you back out into the the game world proper? No, I'm not. What is this? Oh. What's happening? Someone got a new pair of uh, a new set of armor. Oh. I'm going to be looking pretty sharp next time you see me. Boom. We're the greatest. Some slender ladies have dressed for your arrival. What? <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait a second. Hold on. Oh, you look great. New armor. Thank new shield. You. Yeah. I got a new I'm shield a too. Adventurer. I got a new shield too. Oh, you did. Looks like something you'd serve like a meat and cheese uh, tray on. It does. <laughs> You're not wrong. And also, there's a woman in a crop top over here. Whoa. <laughs> Super ripped, dude. Uh, this woman's barely wearing any clothes behind you here, Cloud Aroth. I don't know if you've noticed her behind you. Oh, yeah. I've definitely noticed. I think she's sitting on my head right now. That's just the kind of magnetism I have. Wow. Kind of big deal. Yeah. 